Today we're in Mount Sterling, Kentucky, and we're going to try this Buzz Cup Coffee and Donuts. Um, they look really, really good. So we're going to run inside and pick out some donuts, and uh, we'll be back and show you what we got. So they had all kinds of donuts to choose from. This is a donut shop. So we ordered an apple fritter and a uh, filled, uh, it's a glazed donut filled with raspberry. We got a cinnamon roll. This is a, a strawberry glazed. This is a blueberry. And then this one is a cream, cream filled. filled with chocolate on top. So we were coming to Mount Sterling and we were very rarely in Mount Sterling. I mean, like, I, I, I've been here like three times in my life. I think. Yes. And, and <laughs> the thing is, is not we, that far away either. No, we live in Winchester. And so uh, Mount Sterling is not that far of a drive, no. but we just never have any reason yeah, to come like here. It's like 15 minutes away or something. So I told Kevin, I said, let's try this donut shop. So, and they have coffee, they have a drive through. So mm -hmm. if you want just coffee, you can get coffee yep. from there. That bags of donut holes too thought about buying one but i did they had bags of donut holes <laughs> they had regular glazed donuts yeah, yeah. what had, else did they have besides? they had like a she called them regular donuts they look like like the old-fashioned donuts yes they, they like. had um they had a lemon filled they had custard and then, uh, and then they had the chocolate glazed we picked the cream they also had the custard we will always pick cream mm -hmm. over custard, yeah, I don't like the custard as much. they also uh, we showed you the pink one uh the strawberry they also had one with like pink with like sprinkles mm -hmm. all over the top the homer simpson yeah uh, <laughs> so they they did have a lot to choose from okay so, so we're going first Let's just do the uh, the blueberry yeah, one because it looks looks the it looks the, the, the driest one. Yeah, it it's it looks like the easiest one for him to cut in without getting stuff everywhere. I don't think I'll have to cut it. I'll just break it. Do you mind if I have that box top yeah, and that I guess way so. I can lean over? I yeah. Guess so. They put it. It's like in a, a shirt box. Big box yeah. yeah, it's a shirt box. It depends on how many you order. This is like a, a cake donut. Mm -hmm. That's quite a little blueberry, huh? It, I, my favorite part of it um, is the crust on the outside. Mm, sugary. And because it's sugary and it's crispy. Kind of reminds you of the flavor of like a blueberry muffin. It's because it's got enough blueberries in it. Mm -hmm. And it's not like overly sweet. It's sweet, but it's not like ridiculously sweet. Right. It, it, like um, it has a very light glaze on the outside so kevin's right it's not overly sweet what i am impressed with though is you can really taste the blueberry mm -hmm. and it tastes like real blueberry yep. because we've had blueberry donuts before and it's like yeah. where's the blueberry didn't, didn't have anything in it okay you want to do the strawberry yeah we'll do the strawberry the strawberry it looked like strawberry and i thought that's what because i asked her I, because I, I didn't think it was just pink icing yeah because they had little specks in it like, yeah so and she said they use real strawberries uh to make these i guess i could have held it up before i cut it that's mm -hmm. a yeast donut mm -hmm. that's a really nice donut it's very fluffy mm -hmm. Strawberry is nice. I mean, you definitely know it's strawberry, but it's kind of light. I had to just get strawberry off the top to be able to taste the strawberry at all. I think a little because bit. It's the, very light, but the donut itself doesn't have any strawberries in it. Mm -hmm. um, it's it all the flavor is in the glaze, and for me, it was extremely light. Yeah, well, yeah, it's very, very light. It needs yeah. more, for sure. It, it needs more strawberry. I hate to say that. It needs, like, strawberry flavoring. I know she said he uses real... Um, or more strawberry. One or more two. strawberry. It needs more because yeah. you just can't taste it, It really does. But I do think it's extremely fresh. The donut itself is really, really mm -hmm. good. So if we'd gotten regular glazed donuts, we would have been pretty happy with them. Yeah, oh, yeah. I think so. Absolutely. So okay. I mean, either the... Probably the, the cinnamon roll. The cinnamon. Let's go for cinnamon. Okay, this cinnamon roll, let me just hold it up. It's huge. And we've been to places before where they've had <laughs> cinnamon rolls, and I haven't gotten one. 
And Kevin has said when we've gotten in the car, he's like, I'm surprised you didn't get a cinnamon roll because he lets me pick yep. out everything. So yeah, today, I usually don't care. today, when I saw the cinnamon roll, I thought, I'm going to get that cinnamon roll because he's asked me before. Now, today, when we got back to the car, he said, I'm surprised you didn't get a glaze, just a regular glaze. I'm, you did. You could have cut that into fourths. But you know, they just buy, just pull off the piece. It looks like it's pretty decently. I'm holding onto a box with one hand. Hmm. Mm. That's got a decent cinnamon. It's mostly sweet though. You know what? There's though? a touch of cinnamon there. That really does taste like it it tastes a lot like what you make at home mm -hmm. um with those those uh i'll throw out the name pillsbury just because that's what's coming to my mind um those pillsbury roll mixes that you can make in the oven yeah it, you know they're so delicious that it's no offense against this but it's just it's hard to beat that because it's so good yeah, oh yeah and so this is about honestly it's no better it's no worse it's about the same as what you would make at home yeah it's it's good it's really it's less about the cinnamon it's more about the donut itself it's made right. out of the same um, dough that they make the regular glazed donuts out of so you're really just getting our thick donut really yes. more than anything um, and, and with it, a little bit of cinnamon it's it's a pleasant cinnamon it's yeah. not overpowering no, it's not. but i do think it's very comparable that's something you could do at home yeah. okay know. you want to do apple fritter the apple apple fritter no, hold it uh, listen i it, it, the first time I ever had an apple fritter was since we've been doing YouTube was probably what you think of Disney probably Disney because I never had an apple fritter as a child I had no idea what I was missing out on They're good especially if you get a decent amount of apples mm, that's nice it tastes like they use a, um, like an apple pie filling. It's got a little bit of cinnamon in there, but not a lot, just a touch of cinnamon. Now I like the little crust on it that gives it a little crunchiness. For me, that's what the apple fritter is all about. I know the Kevin, apple? no, not the apple. The crunchiness all around the oh, edges. Yeah. Right. That's my favorite part is that crunchiness. Yeah, uh, they don't have that crispy edge and they're not. Mm -hmm. Not very good. <laughs> um, I think that is delicious. Mm -hmm. And I did get apple. I got is apple. Is there some kind of pecan I, or something in there? A nut? Uh -uh. I don't get the taste of them. Uh, I thought I got the texture of one, but maybe it was just the, the dough itself was crunchy and it mm. just kind of felt like that. Mm, I good. love that. And you that's see really what I did? Eat the edge. Eat the edge because that's the best part. But this, that center was pretty uh, crunchy too. Mm -hmm. they, they did a really good job on the, getting a good crispy edge. Uh, coating on the whole thing yes that will get finished because that is so <laughs> really good. good you might yeah. if you want to hold it so oh. um yeah i love that i'm very impressed with the um the the flavors the texture mm. everything yeah, it's really, really it's good. a perfect apple fritter and it's so much better uh, we'll do whatever one you want to do next i think i'm the chocolate one i think so too um it's so much better like don't go to a grocery store and go to their bakery and get an apple fritter and think that you're getting the same as at a bakery. No. It's not because we, um, I probably did try an apple fritter years ago, but it was from a bakery. And so that kind of ruined me because I thought, <laughs> oh, well, because it wasn't crisp crispy. Right. It wasn't crispy like it should be. And it was kind of chewy coming from a store bakery. And so it was like, oh, this is no big deal. I don't know why people buy these. If you actually get it from a bakery where it's crisp, that's where you want to get it from. You can't judge it by a store. I cut it in half. I didn't get any cream. But if you tear that in half, you get cream. Oh, because I don't, yeah, I don't have any cream. Do you want, here? Well, yeah, because it's, it, I, I'm holding this box so I can't. Can't really do it. So do you have more cream? Yeah, I got cream. Okay. I shoved the whole thing in my mouth. You know what they needed? I think they had a maple. Hmm. One of them looked like maple, but they needed a peanut butter. Peanut butter is hard to get right. Mm -hmm. 
I like the um, I like the chocolate and I like the donut itself. The cream is nice. You just don't get a lot of it. I think it's okay. Yeah, it's not like spectacular, but it's good. Um, I'm not um, sold on the chocolate. Yeah, no, the chocolate tastes like a, something they bought. Yes, it yes, it tastes like, like it's a mix they mixed with water and then they used it. Yeah, it's kind of um, it's kind of that bitter bitter chocolate. Yeah. And I've had it before on something and I'm trying to think of what I've had with that. But then the cream, the I mean, cream it's not bad. It's just just you can tell it's not like homemade chocolate chocolate. Right. And the cream for me, it's not as sweet mm. as you get in a crispy cream. No, it's not nearly as sweet. I would rather this is very fresh. There's nothing wrong oh, with it. Oh, it's a wonderful texture. But I would choose a Krispy Kreme over this. Yeah, I can agree with that. We've, put that over here. Because we've had the Krispy Kreme, and it's it's just better. That's just, you know. Yeah. These now, are huge, by the way. I have to get a raspberry filled everywhere we go, because it's amazing how many, like Krispy Kreme, they know how to do raspberry, and oh. it's very sweet and delicious and we've been to so many bakeries where they've completely missed the mark where like you could hardly even taste it well it looks like there's a lot in there but yes. it's one big blob but it's the there. flavor it's you know the flavor. certain bakeries have just completely missed the flavor but did it right mm -hmm. yeah it's the texture of that strawberry gel you buy to put on strawberry shortcake that's the texture of it. it's not quite jelly like mm -mm -mm. that is i love that that is so good mm. Mm. that's probably definitely one of the sweetest ones we've had probably definitely <laughs> that's what you said <laughs> well i thought probably it's and then i look down it's like definitely now me the whole thing mm. it's uh it's, it's, a whole thing about. it's flaky and it's good. the sugar the glaze the sugar will flake off in your in your mouth and on your fingers and on your feet yeah you can see that white that's good yeah this requires a um a hand wipe we ate the whole thing yeah we did it was good <laughs> i don't um, even like raspberry donuts that much but that was really good there will be no pictures of the insides of these. The, no, no, no. There's really we should, we got a picture of the outside, but it's really hard to get the inside. Oop, I licked my fingers. I did. I've been licking my fingers the whole time. They'll just have to. Well, look. I had um, I had a complaint on a video. Well, one it's person. one person, and it's somebody who's like they're new to the channel, so they just might not know that that we're real people. Yeah, guess and, what? And real people lick their what do they call them they're your handmade you your built-in utensils or it was called something nature's nature's, silverware or something. nature's, nature's utensils, utensils. That's, that's it when you i'm cleaning my utensils yeah when you use nature's utensils you have to clean them off and that person doesn't realize since we're using nature's utensils you have to clean them so they'll just have to go to a different video i mean honestly if i was at home you know we could have a napkin in front of us and stuff like that you know and maybe get it wet could, or whatever but we lick our fingers at but home, we do so. it too. um <laughs> if i was cooking dinner for people i wouldn't do that no but we would never do that if we're cooking for people but it's it just me does. it's me and him we kiss each other too anyway that might cross somebody out too it might <laughs> um my very very favorite one is the raspberry oh yeah definitely i love the raspberry field my second apple. is going to be the apple yeah fruit. i am me too and those are the two that i would get again that's the two i would get the cinnamon roll was nice will you put this back the cinnamon roll i did enjoy the cinnamon roll it was really nice but it was more donut than cinnamon the cinnamon roll just wasn't anything um that i would have to pay for the right. bakery did we give the price um i don't remember if our said. total the bad thing about receipts a lot of times from bakeries is that they don't break it down per donut. So I have a no idea how much these were a piece. Mm. I know because I'm sure I'm sure the apple fritter costs more money yeah. than the uh, strawberry glazed. We just know that our total was $9.30. We got some six. pretty big 
We donuts. got some big donuts. We got some big items. Um, I personally would not get the strawberry again. I wouldn't get the strawberry again. I, honestly, I, I wouldn't get the blueberry. Well, the blueberry was nice. I think if you like a blueberry cake like donut, get it. It was good. If you're wanting something like a blueberry muffin that's not as sweet, yeah, I thought they it. did a really uh, good job. I probably wouldn't get the chocolate glazed filled donut. I would donut. not get, I wouldn't that, get one that one again. either. No. But I would try, there were other like filled donuts like the raspberry. I would try the cream filled one of that because it's mostly going to be donut or the lemon the lemon you said they had lemon they that had would be lemon good. we could have gotten that yeah, yeah I, I swear one of them uh looked like a maple glaze yeah um, that might be good um yeah so they, the only way i like a maple glaze is it has some bacon sprinkled on it <laughs> maple bacon maple Ash, bacon. our daughter actually likes I love that a maple bacon donut. um i do i definitely think this is a nice place to come if you don't want to get out of your car you can go through the window yeah, through. i told the person working the counter when we walked in i said you know your facebook page really helped because a lot of these places a lot of these i mean you can get some well-known chains and they don't update their facebook page but i said seeing the pictures of what you have is what made me want to come in right. because I knew those are our kind of donuts. That's what we're looking for. And so um, that's really important if you're a business, uh, that social media and keeping up those pages, that's something that's important. So um, I'm glad we came. Yeah, I think they're really good. I think if you're coming to Mount Sterling, Kentucky, it would be a great place for you yeah. to stop. Or if you're driving through, um, it's not that far from the interstate. No. It's like a 10 minute, maybe even not even five minute. Drive yeah, it was interstate. really easy to get here, yeah. easy to find and everything. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I will have pictures for you of the whole donuts before we started at the end. And thanks for watching.